Hey everybody. I had a question a while back uh, regarding the cam I was running in this uh, in this IROC. And uh, I thought I'd do a special segment on it and give you some uh, sounds. And some of the sound you've probably heard before in some of my other videos, but we're going to put it all together with some recent uh, recent recordings here. Uh, this car was parked for over 25 years and I didn't trust the cam that was in it. Um, I've saved it, but being that the engine had a lot of corrosion, I wasn't convinced it was a good cam. I wanted to go to a new cam. And as long as I was at it, um, I tried to go just a little bit more aggressive. And, but I didn't want to go wild. Uh, the factory cam in these early IROCs was one of the better cams. So I didn't want to go too far, but uh, the cam technology has changed and, and the, go the goal was to get a little more area under the curve. And there are a couple the cam companies, different ones have a little different uh, methods. But what I chose, I got, got the cam card here, uh, I chose a Lunati for this build. And it's one of their, what they call a Voodoo cam. And so it it lifts the valves a little faster and sets them down a little faster than the cams, the flat tappet cams of the 80s did. Um, this one's a part number 101-207-00 and for a standard small block Chevy 262-400 to 400 V8 um, it's their mildest vert of the Voodoo version cams. Uh, this one has advertised duration of 255 on the intake and 261 degrees on the exhaust and at 50 thousandths uh, valve lift which is really maybe the more critical one it's 207 and 213. Um, I'll put up a slide and show you the difference between the factory cam and the, and the Lunati but the Lunati I say 101 207 00 and that was recommended by the Lunati people for this application uh, because it's a tuned port you don't want to get too wild. If it was a carbureted or if I had a, a, a ram style, you know, a different style intake that doesn't have the long runners on it, the recommendation might have been to go a little bit higher. They said I could use the next step up, but if I used the next step up, it would give me a little bit more horsepower at the top end, but it would hurt the torque curve the rest of the way. And if I use this one, I should get a torque boost all the way through. And frankly, it's pretty satisfying. I mean, it really, you know, it boils the tires when you romp on it from a stop. And it accelerates pretty well. Uh, very well. Um, I think the power is down a little bit at the top end. But that's, I think, a function of my exhaust system still being restrictive. It's a still a stockish type muffler. It's actually, I think, more restrictive than stock looking at the pipe sizes going in. It sounds nice, though. But in any case, um, uh, I've got on my plans is to go go through the exhaust system and try to free it up a little bit. Um, I said no complaints with the way the car runs. Uh, the cam went in. I'm running right now stock timing, um, stock computer chip. I've not modified anything. Um, I know that it gives me a little bit more power if I bump the timing up. Uh, you know the acceleration times get better, uh, but. Um, just bumping the timing up caused other things. It just um, I had some other drivability things, so I put it back to stock, and that's where I'm running it right now. And the videos that you'll see, uh, the clips in a, in a few minutes, are all with the timing set to standard, and a production chip for a IROC tuned port LB9 1985 with um, oh goodness uh, 342 gear. So I'll show you some uh, video of it at idle and uh, and uh, under hood in the back and it's got just a little bit of a look there's a little bit of a vibration that you get in the seat at, at idle but it's not objectionable it sounds nice and it makes good torque you know the mid-range feels really good so um, I said I, I like the cam I think it was a good choice I'm glad that I didn't go bigger and, uh, and so as I say I'm pretty happy with it right now um, here goes.
hope you enjoyed that video. If so, please subscribe to my channel.